Hi, my name is Richard. In this video, I'll be showing you how to use the correlation tab in LeapFrog. In front of us, we have a LeapFrog project consisting of Warhol data and some CPTs. What I'm going to do now is open up the correlation tab in LeapFrog. The correlation tab allows us to correlate data between different boreholes uh, and across numeric data, such as our CPTs. We can add information onto the correlation tab just by dragging and dropping it from the project tree into the tab. We're able to format the data to view it in a variety of ways. In this case, I'm using uh, lines down the holes to see the traces, and I've colored them all so that they stack on top of each other. I've also brought in my saw behavior type as an interval column. I can also create its own interpretation on an interpretation table uh, for which I can create independent lithologies. These lithologies I'm just matching with the existing borehole data in the project. Once I've added that data, I'm able to then correlate either between boreholes or from other data that I have within those columns, such as our CPT traces. We can see that I do this for the rest of our boreholes. Uh, at the bottom of both of these holes um, is where the boreholes terminate. In this case, it's terminating into some sandstone. So I'm just putting a small interval of sandstone at the base of each borehole. And that means that we can use contact points for those holes. And there we go. We have modeling codes that can be used within our LeapFrog model.